So what's next for Sensei? Where do you see technology, neurotechnology uh, advancing to in the future? Say the next 10 years. I, mean, the ult I think that it's, it's a matter of how can we make brain training um, as common as working out at the gym? mainstream like it's just common it's easy to use right so i think we've made great strides with these electrodes but there's room to grow and we already have a, a path in our roadmap for how to improve on that and so in the next 10 years that'll become a non-issue right it'll be easy you can go uh you can probably move like right now it's sensitive to movement so it'll become mainstream and and i think it's it's really critical that it does because we are now facing the future of work and you know for myself I, I have a teenage son and i yeah i'm worried like i don't know his potential for work and it, it looks nothing like my world anything i can conceive of yeah and the distractions from everywhere too nowadays like we didn't have to deal with that uh <laughs> you know growing up yeah so so then we need to make sure that he is um, I would say unlocking his full human intelligence. That's really, that's really the vision of Sensei.